another math class presentation will be seen with this video. Before, we already work on with addition of integers using different chips or the color chips. Today, we'll be working with another method. And let us watch this. Hello, Kamato class. Welcome sa isa na namang discussion on addition of integers. This time around, we will be using another method. And that is using number line. The objective of this presentation is to add integers using number line. Recall that when we talk of number line it started with uh, it composed of the following first is there must be zero from the number line that position dun sa nakaret then when you go to that side to the right side that will be the positive integers on the other side that will be the negative integers. So that's the composition of number line. So you need to draw a line. Then there must be the zero at the right are positive integers. And at the left are the negative integers. Paano ba gamitin ng number line when we talk of add, adding integers? Let us see the rule. Kapag positive, Ang integer na given or in, pupunta ka sa kanan. So, you need to move to the right. At kapag negative ang integer, then you move to the left. Paano ba yung sinasabing going to the right, going to the left, or moving to the right, or moving to the left side? Alamin natin kung paano ito gamitin gamit ang example. With this example, we will be talking of unlike sign. Because when we talk of addition of integers, mayroon tayong tinatawag na unlike sign at like sign. Pag sinabing unlike, magkaiba ng sign yung integers. Kapag sinabing like sign, parehas ng sign ang Integers. So, sa example na to, find the sum of 4 and negative 5, this is unlike sign. Isang positive at isang negative. Paano ba gamitin ng number line? Let's start with the number line. So, you need to start always with 0. So, dapat yun yung starting point mo when we apply number line. Then, the first Integer is 4 and that's positive from the rule. Ibig sabihin, you need to move to the right side. Like this one. You move to the right, but you started with 4. Let's count it. So, I started with 0. I mean, let's count it. 1, 2, 3, 4. So, from 0, apat na units that represent positive 4 going to the right. That means to say, from 0, you stay at 4. Next is to add it by negative 5. Since it is negative, you need to move to the left side. So, from 4, kung saan ka naka-stay kanina, you need to move to the left. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That represent negative 5. From 4, nakarating ka sa negative 1 at negative 1 yung last position mo that means to say when we add 4 plus negative 5 
is equal to negative 1. Because negative 1 is your last position. I hope you understand the first example. Let's proceed with the second one. The second one is to find the sum of negative 3 and 7. Again, this is unlike sign. 1 negative and 1 positive. Let's start again with the number line. Again, ang first position ay 0. The first integer is negative 3. And that's negative. According to the rule, you need to move to the left side. From 0, 1, 2, 3. That represents negative 3. From 0, nakarating ka sa negative 3. Then, we are going to add it by 7. 7 is positive. That means to say, you move to the right. So, last position na negative 3. Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. That represent positive 7. From negative 3, nakarating ka sa 4. And that will be your last position. And that will be also the answer when we add negative 3 plus 7. And that is equal to 4. So that's when we talk of unlike sign. How about when we talk of this? Negative 3 plus negative 2. So you will notice that the sign of the integers are same. So ito naman yung sinasabi natin like sign. So we will be adding like sign. Let's start with the number line. Again, ang first position is 0. So from 0, the first integer is negative 3. That means to say you need to move to negative 3 from our rule. Moving to the left from 0, 1, 2, 3 units. That represent negative 3. From 0, nakarating ka sa negative 3. Let's proceed. The next integer, integer I mean is negative 2. That's again negative, you move to the left. So from the last position, 1, 2. That represent negative 2. From negative 3, nakarating ka sa negative 5. And that will be your last position na magiging sagot when we add negative 3 plus negative 2 is equal to negative 5. How about if it is positive and positive? Like this. 2 plus 4, again, we are adding like sign. Let's have this number line. We start again with 0. The number line, ang first given natin ay 2. That's positive. You need to move to the right. 1, 2 units. That represent positive 2. So from 0, nakarating ka sa 2. The next integer is 4. From 2, again, you need to move to the right. 1, 2, 3, 4. That represent positive 4. So, ang last position mo ay 6 because from 2, nakarating ka sa 6. So, that means to say 2 plus 4 is equal to 6. So, I hope that you learn using number line. So, just remember that when we talk of a positive integers, you need to move to the right. And when we talk of negative integers, you need to move to the left. That's all. God bless us.